Hi Aries, so this is my first ever actual zodiac sign reading. So I'm just going to do a general general topic, a love topic and a career topic. And we're just going to see how this goes. If this doesn't resonate, then let it fly. I have some pick a card reasons that you can have a look at if this doesn't correlate to you. But if it does, then that's great. Let me know because this is my first ever reading that I've done with the actual zodiac signs. And we're just going to see how this goes. So we have positive energy. Wow, that's really, really nice. And we're just going to pull a card from the Rider Waite Tarot deck. And let's see what you guys got. Please clarify this positive energy. Okay, got the Six of Pentacles. And we have the Page of Swords. And we have the Death card. Wow, okay, so, so first of all, let's just say with this energy, first of all, we have positive energy, so that's really, really good. Um, it says, surround yourself with positive people and situations and avoid negativity. So what I'm feeling is with this week, I feel like you're going to be very sensitive. Basically, over this month, you're going to be quite sensitive. You're going to feel like you're going to be a bit of a recluse. You're going to want to be in a bit of a hermit mode, I'm feeling. I'm feeling like this isn't your general energy because normally Aries are quite fiery, are fiery and... I wouldn't say hard-headed, not hard-headed, that's not the right word. Fiery and... I'm getting the word forth right. So they go for what they want. And this, this week you are kind of in a bit of a middle stage at the moment with the death card. I never really see this card where it's to do Aries because death is a very, very, very strong energy. It's almost like the depths of hell kind of energy. You are kind of going through the depths of hell at the moment and I feel like you're gonna come out really, really rejoicing because the Page of Swords is a very new, fresh kind of baby energy. So basically the overall energy for this week and I reckon for actually this month, the rest of this month, is you're going to be going through a very positive transformation. And I feel like you're gonna be meeting a few new people as well. Um, this doesn't apply to everybody but I feel like some people could really be helping you bring up your energy and kind of bring it to fruition so yes yeah, so that's the overall energy and let's see what you have in love okay so now let's have a look at your love energy for the month of April and for this week okay right we've got three cards here so they all came out at the same time so I'm thinking this is basically just for you I wasn't going to think, oh, I'll just pull out one card. <laughs> the energy's like, let's just properly go for it. So we've got the Two of Swords, You Deserve Love, Worth Waiting For and a Wedding. So basically I'm going through the rest of this reading and it, and I do say it's a weekly, but basically saying that it's basically for, basically, basically, this is actually for the rest of the month going forward. So <clears throat> this could be in the next two weeks as well. Just to let you know, I've kind of decided in between making this video that I want to do it for the rest of the month because I'm, that's the energy that I'm feeling. I don't feel like this is just for the week. So, in love, I feel like with this energy, you guys are kind of deciding whether you want to actually be in a relationship or if you do want to be in a relationship, there's kind of two options that are kind of hanging around. I want to see what this, these two options are because I'm not too sure what this Two of Swords is actually about. I've kind of got a feeling that it might be deciding whether you want to be with this person or not. But I'm not too sure. Page of Wands. Okay, so what I'm seeing is for you in love is I'm seeing you're kind of looking out to possibilities. So I'm kind of feeling that the person you're with at the moment or the person that you're kind of thinking about, you're kind of like, meh, don't really know if I want to be with this person. But if you do want to be with this person, then there's definitely a possibility that it could go really, really well. The other option is that there's kind of two options and the fact that we've got divine timing is at work in your love life and worth waiting for is the fact that I feel like a lot of you actually watching this aren't in a relationship at the moment and you're still waiting on that that person for the next couple of month, couple of weeks I don't see somebody coming in for you yet so also if you can hear a lawnmower I'm sorry my neighbours have decided to cut their grass <laughs> so yeah so I definitely feel like there's there's a love coming in it's just not here yet i don't feel like it's going to come in in the next couple of weeks but you have been working on yourself and you're deciding kind of where you want to go and what you want to do i feel like also a new job opportunity could actually help you get into this love life um this new love 
and the person who you're going to be with you're probably going to get married to them because it says this situation involves marriage or the person that you want to be with is married and you're not you kind of want to be with them but they're married so you're kind of like oh this is a bit awkward so that's the quick message for the next couple of weeks and the rest of the month so let's see what you guys have for work so what's happening in Aries work life please Wow, happily ever after. God, these cards are flying out. Whoa, okay, okay, <laughs> okay, okay. Wow, okay, so there's definitely a new job opportunity coming in for you guys. I feel like it could actually be by the end of the month, there could be a new opportunity for you guys coming in. The Page of Pentacles um, shows to me that there's kind of a new opportunity that's being given to you. And it's like a very new energy. As I said, the page is to do with new baby energy and you already had the page before. So it's definitely like new things are coming in for you. I feel like they're coming in quite slow and you're getting quite agitated about it. But trust your intuition that everything will be okay. Trust your intuition in the job that you want. If you're kind of in between jobs at the moment and you kind of don't know what you want to do, trust your intuition that everything's going to be okay because it's going to end up in a really good position so let's just see what your emotions are to do with your job career life at the moment just going to pull an animal card for you guys okay let's see so we've got think on your feet there we go so i definitely feel like if you are in a job right now and you're kind of i feel like a couple of you a few of you could be in a project at the moment where you have to think on your feet it's very new energy so i definitely feel like you guys might be starting a new project as well and it's definitely like it's fast thinking energy and I whenever I see the fox spirit I always think of Aries and any fire sign because it's red and it's got that gorgeous kind of pushing sort in a, in a good way like kind of fiery let's go 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 kind of energy so you're definitely in your element at the moment and I feel like this could actually be frustration as well there could be frustration to move forward when it's not the right time to move forward it could be also where you're in a position that you're dealing with somebody who you don't really like but if you work for yourself also you could be raising your standards and working on yourself i think as well anybody who is in work is basically you're raising your standards anyway and overall you're thinking about yourself and what you really truly need and what really makes you happy and i definitely feel like you guys are really channeling that aries energy that kind of fiery what's going to be my passion for this energy god there's so much noise outside i can hear an ice cream truck i can hear a lawnmower <laughs> oh my god this this reading's crazy so yeah this is basically the overall energy for you guys it's very very positive just keep doing what you're doing raise your standards make sure you are really bringing in that aries energy and you're really thinking positive and you're really thinking positively about your life because it's really going really going well for you may time i really do think that you could actually find this job that you're looking for if you're looking for jobs at the moment i can definitely see you working on a really nice whole whole project in april it's very whole it's very um wholesome so something that's going to really really suit you so if this resonates for you guys please let me know this is the first reading that i've done that are specific signs so let me know in the comments down below subscribe to my channel if you'd like to i'm thinking about doing more of these in the future if you guys enjoy them if they're accurate then i will carry on doing them I feel like someone just sucked up a flip-flop into their lawnmower. <laughs> um, so yeah, thank you for watching and I'll see you all very soon. Bye!